you know they have wigs regular wigs I don't really like them if you're not doing buying the right ones but things to stay away from the chemical stay away from the chemical the chemicals I mean I use them all the time but you know I went through something where I was taking out people's hair and I have a video about that or a couple of videos about that and it was coming out from the root and it was going on for a while and I just couldn't understand what was going on and I keep on asking my distributor what's going on and he's saying there's nothing and I just felt like I was doing something wrong I did not know what was going on because it's not like a breakage from the ends it was people were going bald from the root you know when I finally realized what was going on um, with this one client it led me to start looking into the ingredients of the product so I did a lot of research with the ingredients of the makeup of, of not just only the, the the color that I was using because it's a color but other things as well the relaxer the this the that and then they're tested and then you have this big word on the side of it cause called carcinogen and that's the next another word for cancer and it kind of scared me it did scare me but then I know that they tested on the animals and whatever and you know we've been using for years even though nothing may happen to you immediately over time it may happen and especially if your body's breaking down and you know your hormones are changing and the you know the cells are changing and things are developing you know um, things can happen so for me I was very careful about relaxers before I'm even more careful about relaxers now okay with the the hair coming out with that um, what happened is the company I was using Clairol for many many years I've been using Clairol been using I mean their rinses their permanence and the semi permanence then I start to use their demi and then the demi they change it over to soy demi soy demi I got excited because you know I have women with um, menopausal so you know they're always sweating the pores are opening the hair getting finer and thinner and blah 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 so um, you know the the rinses doesn't cover their grays it's hard it's some um, unpigmented hair you know, it's that pigment so it's very hard to cover and I find the demi very very good coverage but the definition of a demi it's not supposed to change anything in the cortical layer so it should be safe enough to use along with a relaxer or two weeks after a relaxer without causing any problems. The problem with that Demi was they added ammonia and they added sodium hydroxide to the color. Now I did not know this. Now I understood why it was coming out from the root. The color is not supposed to have ammonia. It said no ammonia. But in the ingredient, one of it, the ingredient said soy trimonium chloride, which means ammonia mixed with soybean oil. So that soy on the box in deep penetrating healthy shine, the soy is good, but it's mixed in with the chemical, so it's still chemical. Follow? And then they put sodium hydroxide. Sodium hydroxide, you know what it does to the hair, like I said before. It breaks down the cuticle layer and changes the cortex into whatever it, it does. So when they added those two things to the color, I'm relaxing the hair as a regular treatment and then or two weeks later you put a color onto that now when you put the color on the hair the hair doesn't have enough new growth even if you're doing a retouch the hair doesn't have enough new growth so when you put that color on it's overlapping with the relaxer from two weeks prior hello and then that's when it caused the damage because it's overlapping and I'm constantly overlapping and the hair you know grows quarter of an inch to a half an inch a month so there's no way I'm gonna successfully put this on without overlapping got me when they did that you can tell that they're not researching black people we need black scientists we really 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 need some black scientists on our side because you know look at this woman has cancer and the one thing that she does the relaxer the the the, the most potent um, compound that you can put onto your skin they're not even telling her not to use it because they're not thinking about that they're not thinking about that the white people all they do is the color 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 some of them do the perms and stuff but color most of them do the color you know and if they're doing their retouch every six weeks they're only doing color retouch you know when they're doing their 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 highlights it's like maybe a half an inch away from the scalp or whatever it is so it's not going on to the scalp whereas we're doing relaxer retouch and the color retouch and then right after that we want to put the glue onto our hair and then I hear Michael Bazin I was listening to his program talking about some woman that died from the glue 
I couldn't understand, but she did. And that's in my video as well, because we're doing chemical, chemical, and chemical. We want to put the relaxer on her hair, the color on her hair, and the glue on her hair, all in the same time. And the pores is open and accepting and absorbing all of this stuff. So what's going to happen? Problems, you know? So we're not paying attention, and the companies are not paying attention. They're making these things for us, and they're not even going out in the street. Go interview somebody. Go to the salons and interview somebody and ask what's going on. What's going on in black world today? You know, now on the TV, they're free with talking about black people, white people, and whatever. Go to The View. They're Sherry and, and, and Whoopi, even though she wear a lot of wigs, and Whoopi has the, the, the dreads. I'm pretty sure one of them went through chemicals in their life. Go to Robin Roberts. Go to, you know, go to Oprah, um, Oprah hairdresser. Go to, go to somebody. You know what I mean? Go to some of the music rock stars. Go to somebody and ask what's going on in the black world today. People are blogging all the time. Go to one of those bloggers and ask what's going on in the black world today. They really need to pay attention to us. You know, the, the billions of white people that support them can't make them billions just by, you know, they need more billions. So the rest of the billions of black people that's supporting them, they need to you know, research that. They need to research that. You see these companies now that's been white all this time. Now they're putting um, black faces on the product to make you know, oh, yeah, it's good for black hair and yeah, yeah, yeah. But you're not doing the research. Why aren't you doing the research? Why aren't these doctors know that the relaxers, again, it's so high. It's so high as a compound, as an alkaline agent. And they're not telling the cancer patients that are going through their chemotherapy to stay away from it until. So I just want to um, put that out there. I just really want to put that out there. So hopefully um, I'm not too far off. And I hopefully, like, if somebody sees this and, you know, get it out. Get it out there. You know, we all in this together. We may not know each other, but I'm pretty sure that we know one person that have had issues with cancer or have been, you know, touched by it in some form, way, shape, or form. So, till next time.